AI is extremely good at taking this input image and then making it a video just like this. If you want to learn how to do this and you are at the exact right video, we're going to use Gen 2 from Runway ML and all you have to do is go to Runway ML and then open Gen 2. Pick an image that you like to make a video about and in this particular case, we're going to use an image from Unsplash. Also, when you select an image, you need to be very sure about how do you want to see this to be made as a video because you need to know what are the elements in that video could be actually made interpolated into a video. So that kind of intuition is quite important for you to make that. Once you have that clear idea, all you have to do is go upload that image on Runway ML and then you are going to see the magic. After you upload the image, it is important for you to not give any prompt. Do not give any prompt. Meanwhile, you can check basic settings where you can see Runway ML currently lets you create four seconds video. All you have to do is click generate. And once you click generate, you are going to start making the video. Or in fact, I have to say that you are just summoning the AI to start generating video. While the video is being generated, let's see a quick video about the potential of Runway ML Gen 2, the model that we are using for this. This video is definitely not sponsored by Runway ML or anybody. No. So let's start the video. AI has done its job in making the video. All we have to do is go play the video. If you want, you can see what the prompt is. When you play the video, you can see the car trying to turn and you can also see the shadows moving. That's that's a very interesting intuition. So when you have got car and then you've got sunlight and it also knows that, you know, the shadow has to move. So it has got that much understanding or when you are trying to do the interpolation in latent space, it has that much intuition to understand what are the parts to be animated and it has done a tremendous job. Not necessarily the best perfect video, I would say, but still for uh, just a few clicks of button, this four second video is quite good. Let's look at another example with the stable diffusion created Llama pictures. As usual, select the picture and upload it on Runway ML. Once you upload it, do not add any prompt. Just click generate and it will start generating the video. So under the hood, it is trying to create an interpolation in the latent space, imagining what could be the end of this video. And then it is trying to create the frames between those things and then ultimately creating a four second video. This could be extremely helpful if you want to translate or turn your input image into a video without you having to tell it what kind of video you want. Like you want a shot of a beach with waves, then you can easily do it. And that's exactly what we're going to do it with the llama. So we have got two llamas with guitar and you can see it has done a tremendous job of making these llamas play with the guitar. And in fact, they're dancing. So it understands this context about, okay, you have got a guitar and it's not like llamas are going to stand straight and they are actually dancing. I think this is a tremendous achievement and Runway ML is truly leading the way. There is one more startup that does this job, Pika Labs. I recently got access to Pika Labs and I cannot wait to try Pika Labs. Until that, you can try Runway ML with some free credits. Of course, before they make everything paid, try it out and then let me know what do you feel about this amazing technology. See you in another video. Happy prompting.